The technology contained within the modern motor car can be both fascinating but slightly baffling nowadays as well. Most of such technology exists to make our cars safer, more efficient and just better than ever to drive. But some of it can be quite confusing for the average motorist. So in this A to Z series, we will attempt to unravel the mystery of technology that is the modern motor car. This week, the letter I. I is for I-PACE. The I-PACE is still a concept car for the time being, but it's been developed by Jaguar Land Rover as an all-electric vehicle for full production in future. And thanks to its twin electric motors and lithium-ion battery pack, it has as much torque as a 5-litre supercharged V8 F-Type SVR. It will stop very effectively too, because an electric brake booster replaces the normal vacuum servo, ensuring maximum flexibility and braking power while maintaining excellent pedal feel, say Jaguar Land Rover's engineers. I is for Inconnel. Inconnel is a nickel-chromium alloy metal that can withstand temperatures from well below zero to over 100 degrees centigrade, and it's used for the F-Type SVR's exhaust system. Not only does it help generate the unique exhaust load, as you can hear, but it also saves 16 kilograms compared to the conventional stainless steel exhaust. I is for in-car protection, or airbags to put it another way. The airbag itself was invented in the 1970s, but modern systems like those used in Jaguar Land Rover's vehicles have become a lot more sophisticated and are a lot more effective in reducing passenger injuries in an accident. Jaguar Land Rover's airbags have a so-called soft landing technology that prejudges the size and weight of the occupants and then adjusts the airbag contact accordingly. Anti-whiplash systems also move the headrests forwards slightly to support the neck in a collision and the car then sends out an immediate text message to the emergency services once an airbag has been deployed. Never before have you been safer travelling inside a car that's involved in an accident thanks to technology like this. Next week, the letter J. 